Hello, Librans. Uh -huh. Hello, my Librans. This is a Taurus season. The season begins from April 20th until May 20th. All right, Librans, let's see what is happening, what is transpiring. What is the message for you, um, uh, Librans, in the season? I see a situation is not yet over. A lot of you Librans are in some sort of a hardship in the second week. Um, in the third week, light has been shed on some sort of a situation that has to do with a whole lot of money. And they are recognizing that a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn per man, um, whether it's a businessman or your father or your partner, you are going to be dealing with this man. This man is 50 years and older. They are now recognizing and seeing the truth of what this man have done. And I see this man is going to be having to deal with a lot of hardship that is coming in his life. All right, Librans. So... This is the Taurus season. The Taurus season has four weeks, all right? And you Librans, you are in um the um the eight the seventh house, all right? So um this is an energy that is happening in your second house. So Librans, this is the second house energy. So this four weeks uh, has to do with your money and financial stability. The energy of the Taurus uh, season is the second house. And the second house is your money and financial stability. And you Librans are dealing with a Taurus man. And they're recognizing the truth of this Taurus man and what has transpired. All right. So Librans, let's look at the first week, the week of the 20th of April until the 26th. You have the Six of Swords, Mercury in Aquarius, Mercury in Aquarius. Mercury is about communication. Aquarius is about investigation. So some of you Librans could have been dealing with some sort of an investigation, okay? Um, you could have been connected in some sort of an investigation that is going on around you, Librans. It could be affecting a family member or someone around you. But there is some sort of an investigation that is not yet over. So the energy of the Six of Swords is about some of you wants to leave a situation behind and move forward. But you can't because there is some sort of a... um situation that first needs to end before you can move forward so mercury is about some sort of a communication and communication is about whenever aquarius comes up aquarius is about the uranus and it's about a group of people okay and um a group of people somehow some of you um liberals are connected with a group of people that was you were dealing with some sort of an issue and some sort of a problem and it's not yet over so april 20th until the 26th you liberals have to be dealing with this uh, situation and you're hoping for some sort of a new story so here it is i told you investigation this is a i um, I, I professional person and this person is coming up and there is some sort of an investigation that you are connected with. And if you are a loyal, um, I see that whatever the situation is, you're going to be successfully overcoming this person because they have now recognized what this person have done. If you are a lawyer, you're going to be still stuck in the situation. And it's as if you're working on a case and this case is... Uh, um, you know, still going on and as if you are like, I wish this thing would have been over. Okay. Some of you is some sort of a legal issue. There's a high professional person that is coming up as a priest, lawyer, doctor, judge, you name it. So some sort of an unconventional situation that was happening and transpiring. You're going to be successful, um, overcoming this and getting out of this, but yet still it is not over. Okay. So, you will be successful. There is no question. But in this week, it's not the week when it's going to be over. It is still ongoing. So I hope a lot of you understand what this is, what this energy means. And this energy is for a lot of you is as if you were divorcing. Okay. Because that is an Aquarian energy. 
you were divorcing, you had something to do with a group of people who are, you had gotten in a connection with and they have brought you down the wrong side of the road and a lot of you are trying to get out of it. You will successfully get out of it, but it is not yet over, all right? So when the fat lady sink, it will be over, um, but you are recognizing now that you got caught up in this situation. So there is not going to be a new start for a high professional person, whoever this high professional person is. They are going to be making sure that this person do not get a new start. They recognize what this person have done. A lot of you are dealing with the scorpions. Um, whoever the scorpion is and whatever it is transpiring, a lot of you liberals are dealing with a scorpion. Um, and this scorpion could have gotten you connected in some sort of a, um, legal issue or some sort of an investigation or some sort of a problem with a group of people. But you will, um, you know, it's not yet over. And I see that the scorpion might get out and you might get stuck in this situation. So a scorpion might release themselves and get out of it. But I see that some of you liberals are going to be stuck in the situation now as we look at the second week the second week is from the 27th of april until the 3rd of may and there is some sort of a financial hardship some sort of a hardship and they're going to be recognizing that you librans have gotten uh, in connection um with some sort of undesirable situation now what we're seeing here is the hardship and it has to do with a girlfriend you liberals could have connected with a girlfriend and whoever this girlfriend is was not very honest um you could have been in some sort of a connection with a girlfriend i don't know if it is a scorpion a taurus or an aquarium but whoever this girlfriend is um this person uh, is connected to some sort of a group that got you liberals in some sort of an undesirable situation that you did not see coming. And this is now affecting you liberals. So you got to recognize how you got in this situation. And I see they're going to be blocking this person. So whoever this person is, they are recognizing that this person was very, very... um dishonest okay because they're placing a block on this person and whether this person is is in some sort of a serious serious problem and it is coming up as a um the energy of the fox this person was a fox so this person could be coming up as a taurus a woman or an aquarian an aquarian or a taurus so, but whether this person is an aquarian a taurus or a scorpion person is going to be blocked it is coming up as a sister a girlfriend someone um, that you had some sort of a conventional situation with because they have created a whole lot of problems for you liberals and whether this person is is now going to be blocked now whenever a block comes up that means this person is not going to be moving forward in their life for whatever the reason is and whatever they have created they have created a whole lot of issues and problems for other people and people are now recognizing what they have done however you librans seems to be connected to this person whether it's a friend your sister or a family member you are connected with this person and this person have brought you in some real unsavorable play that they were in and connected with a group of people now as we look at this five of pentacles it has to do with something to do with a whole lot of money because this is the energy of the second house and this person could have paid you liberals to do something and have brought you in some serious trouble and this is a situation that is now this person is going to be blocked so you liberals whoever you liberals or that was connected with a friend or a girlfriend or a sister or whoever this person is they are now going to be blocked now the possibility that you some of you liberals could be blocked could be coming up depends on um what you have done because i see a lot of you liberal is in some sort of a hardship in the week of the 27 to may 3rd 
so um blockages are placed when people create chaos for other people and now um they are in and uh, you know stuck between um the the rock the 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 hard place between a mirror and a rock um in order to get out and uh, reorganize reorganize themselves so you be careful Libran of who is this person and who is this girlfriend because this girlfriend could have done something unconventional it's coming up as an Aquarian or a Taurus person that could have done something unconventional you are connected to this person and you got caught up with it so it can be um and if um uh, you have a girlfriend that is an Aquarian, this person could be blocked. Or if you have a girlfriend that is in some sort of a legalities, notary and that sort of a thing, lawyers, and they could be blocked. And so are you connected to this person? So be aware of what is transpiring in your world. So hardship is going to be coming in for you liberals in this week. You got to be careful. Let's look at the week of... Uh, 4th of May until 10 May. Light has been shed. This week is a significant week. Um, this is a week where you gotta recognize and look. You gotta take the blindfolds off and look. Librans, this week, the week of May 4th till May um, 10, you gotta take your blindfolds off. Look around you. Recognize, observe what is going on around you. A lot of sadness. A lot of sadness is going to be coming up for you, Librans, whatever that was happening and transpiring, Librans. Something came out and a whole lot of sadness. You're dealing with your boss. You're dealing with managers. You're dealing with your parents. Um, you're dealing with people in authority, Librans, and a whole lot of sadness, Librans. So, uh, Librans, it is the story season is really a sensitive, sensitive see, um, um, season for you. And you got to recognize uh, with these seasons, uh, because you are um, the energy of the eight, uh, the seventh house, and um, this is a, a, a the second house, which is materialistic and um, your financial stability, you got to be alert and aware because I see some sort of information came out. And the information could be that some of you liberals were played <clears throat> to get some sort of a information or uh, some of you liberals are really having some serious issue with your parents. So liberals, um, if you are a parent, you could be recognizing something about your kids and a whole lot of sadness. So liberals, however, it is coming up. There is going to be a whole lot of sadness and a whole lot of situation where you liberals, information is going to be coming out in the third week. And I see a whole lot of sadness for you liberals. So... Um, hold on tight and recognize where you are. See through the veils of illusion, whoever is trying to create illusions. Understand that uh, the, the information that you're going to be receiving, you need to receive this information. It has something to do with your boss. Your boss could be telling you or giving you some sort of uh, information, but it ha has something to do with your parents for some of you. And uh, for some of you, it has to do with people in authority. So we're talking about uh, you getting a letter. Um, maybe it is uh, for the vaccination. You don't want the vaccination, whatever it is about it could be getting some sort of a health news, okay? Um, that is going to be coming up. So remember May 4th until May 10th, there is some sort of a sadness, some information that is going to be coming to you that is going to be shedding light and is going to be creating some sort of a sadness for you liberals, okay? And it is in the time of May, uh, May 4th till May 10th. And this situation, um, you have to recognize the and, and see the truth. 
some of you Libras um, was um, putting the blindfolds up and it's as if you need to remove the blindfolds, okay? Um, because by removing this blindfold, um, you are not going to be surprised, but you, you know, it is as if something about your kids, something about who you are as a person, something about, because this is the energy of the hermit and the energy of the hermit is about going within and your guiding angels could have been showing you something about yourself that you never wanted to recognize. And this is really heavy for you liberals, but it is what it is. And you have to be aware um of the situation and these problems that you're going to be facing and getting and and and, and getting and you need to resolve it and it is um a situation where these season readings they don't choose you you choose them um so it is what is going to be coming out so remember go and choose one of these stones to help you out of uh, whatever the problem the issue is because you got to choose one of these stones, Libra, in order to release you and help you to understand the direction in or how to go in the new direction in order to clear stability in your world. And this is what the crystals are for. So choose one of these crystals and see what is the energy that is coming out in the third week, whichever of this crystal um, calls upon you liberals, you got to choose it and see how to resolve whatever the problem is. We're moving on to the fortune last week. That is the week of 11th of May until the 20th. So there I said it, um, liberals, you were dealing with a businessman. Um, <clears throat> I did said it. You were dealing with a businessman, whoever this businessman is, whether a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn businessman, Whoever this businessman is, a lot of you liberals was dealing with this businessman. This businessman could have connected to some sort of an ulterior figure. So that is its sadness. Some sad news from um this businessman is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person is not a very nice person. This person is a very deceptive person and not really nice. So, um, whoever this person is, liberal has gotten you in some serious, serious trouble. And now <laughs> you are receiving some sort of a message because light shed on this person and you're not recognizing this person is not who they say they were. Okay. So here it is. This man, is it your husband? For some of you, it could be your husband, your partner that you were connected to in some sort of a relationship. This man is a businessman. This man could be a businessman that you were having some sort of an affair with. And uh, I see you're going to be moving towards this businessman or this boss or this man. But this man is financially strong. So a lot of you, if you are looking for some sort of a financial stone or someone to um, protect you or help you out financially, I see some of you are going to be turning to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn businessman or a businessman. Let's say that, you know, this person liked you and you never really um, give a second thought to this person. All of a sudden, I see you're going to be moving towards this person in the last week. Some of you, it could be this businessman is trying to create a whole lot of issues and problems, but that was in the third week. Um, and some of you, whoever the star is for, where a Capricorn businessman is, you could be meeting this man, but this man is not who he said he really is, okay? So this man could be giving you some sort of a sweet story and, you know, saying, I can do this and I can do that for you. But in honesty, this man is giving you some sort of a, um, sweet stories that is not uh, very, it's not the honesty, okay? It's not honest what this man is trying to propose to you or offer you. So it could be a situation where your boss in the fourth week is going to say, hey, Libra, if you, you become my personal secretary or if you can travel and drop this off at someone, you might just get yourself in some sort of a problem because whatever they are giving you to take to this person is not what they say what is in the package. So, you know, Libra, you got to be aware. 
you got to be aware, Librans, of who this person is, how they come in your world in this last week, and how they're going to be affecting you. Because if you recognize this man is in the reverse, and once this man is in the reverse, and there's two things that is happening. This man um, is offering you something, but whatever he's offering you, expect that you have to repay double or triple. Okay, and it's not showing up well, who this man is, whether it's a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, it is just a businessman, and that is what you know about this person. It's a businessman. This man, whether he is seeing you and he likes you and he wants to help you, it is a business. He doesn't see you as uh, having a relationship. This is about business for this man. So, if some of you were looking for a, you know, really rich, financial, stable person. You might meet this person, but know that there is no love that you're going to be getting from this person. This person is going to be someone who is going to be flowing you with a lot of gifts, so, but yet still, he needs something. So if that's the person you're looking for, that's okay. But if you are looking for some sort of a stable relationship or uh, you know, you 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 won't get that love and affection and deep. And this person is going to see you as their toys. Okay, so you gotta recognize this. So don't put um your faith in this person. This is basically when someone is in reverse, they're saying don't put your faith in this person because this person is in reverse for a reason. Do not put your faith in the stars where we're Capricorn man because they're not who they say they really are. You're going to be seeing another side of this man because this man is going to be using you to pay off whatever debt that you owe. So, this is a serious. A serious case. There is no question about it. And it's a serious situation. For some of you, it is good. And, you know, this last week, the week of the um, 11th of May until the 20th, could be, you know, one of those weeks. And it's your best week, basically. Because the rest of the weeks is not that positive as you recognize what is coming up. And this last week, maybe this is your guided angel, but this 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 person needs something else, okay? So no matter what this person does for you, uh, Librans, they're going to be looking back for something else, okay? This, so this person thinks of everything in their life as a business. And... You might meet this person. This person is going to be offering you, so be careful, all right? I do love you, Librans. Please show your love by thumbs up so that the videos can pick up the algorithm. Um, this is powerful. You're aware of what is coming out in the story season. Hold on tight. You will get through this. Come back each week to listen and choose one crystal. The link will be down uh, beneath, uh, below this reading. And you can choose your crystal. Um, and um, if you're having some sort of an issue, it's a, I think it's $1.99 or so to become a member of the channel. Um, the first Saturday in every month, you can get um, a reading. I gotta go. Namaste.